Runs exactly the time. Yeah. <laughs> Never misses. <laughs> Event 18, 7.18 p.m. time. 7.18 p.m. Actually amazing. Yeah. <laughs> like, think of all the track art. meets you've been to. Yeah. And just how often they run behind time. Miles Club? Never. Oh, no rain, cool breeze, ideal Oh, conditions. yeah, just, just send you an your update track side. We're expecting live updates. I was actually going to get some food, but the line was too long and the, the races are just heating up. So I know, you can't step yeah. away. <laughs> I'll, go, to, I'll go hungry. Wait, feel free to step out of the box for the men's F1500, though, if you want. Yeah. We'll just let that one go dark. Nah, I'm excited. Trying for win. Women's B800, 11 competitors in this one. Okay, if we're going to start it now, I'm going... Athlete with the Brooks. fastest seed time, Declan Tanner for me. All right, game on. Can I go two for... Th- oh, apparently. <laughs> yeah, one, one for one. one. <laughs> I didn't see the last one. Make their way around. I think it's going to be Lucy Delbridge of Collingwood in that white and black famous stripe. Uh, just sliding in behind is Declan Tanner. Oh of Mornington, <laughs> Mornington Athletics Club. Allie Brooks looks the goods. She's, she's on the outside there. They're going to bunch right up here. So always starts fast, but they're always able to bring themselves back 30 seconds through the first 200 metres. So plenty of pace <laughs> on it here in the women's B800 metre. For a bunch of athletes uh, aiming to run under 2.15, 30 seconds for the first 200 is flying. Emily McLean from Glen Huntley throws herself in the mix as well. Delbridge, McLean. And that might be Erica Fountain from Ballerine in third position. They are one, two, three. And Jong now. Jamie Wainwright of Mornington crashing the party as well. But Delbridge led from the start, going through in a 66 67. So we would have to even split or negative split to get a bunch of PBs here at Box Hill Myers Club. And unfortunately, my call in Declan Tanner is just sliding away back into the field. Similar to Ali Brooks there. So I don't think we've quite nailed this one, but they're still putting in solid performances as she's been leading from the start here, our athlete from Collingwood in Lucy Delbridge. And she's just going to try and take it out. Julie Fit of Box Hill on the outside there and Emma De Jong behind there from Maccabee Athletics Club. But as we make our way around with 200 metres to go... Wainwright. Wainwright. Jamie Wainwright of Mornington Peninsula. 150 metres to go. Gets up on the shoulder of Delbridge. Julie Fit is trying to join the party as well. Up on the podium, they're charging towards the finish line. Wainwright has waited, waited, waited. Now she goes bang. Julie Fit doing all she can on her home track to make sure it's not the Wainwright show. But Wainwright has taken the win. I'm going to call it 20, 30 wow. metres out in a time of 2.12, 2.13. Julie Fit, strong finish as well. And we didn't even mention Isla Bradshaw, who comes from the clouds. Running on clouds. Well, like to <laughs> say, has she got the shoes on? <laughs> wow, wait. So Jamie Wainwright, that's a PB. Nice little PB, tidy PB. And Julie Fit as well might have collected a couple of second PB as well. Um, okay, so neither of us called the winner there. No, but I'm one from two. so it's Yeah, okay, good. okay. Yeah. Well, I'm fine. I'll believe you. I've got one. So our women's B800 belongs to Mornington Peninsula. All right, all right, all right. Men's B. Okay. Coming up next. So three more 800-meter races for this evening, and then we have 20 1,500 meters to look forward to. Yes! And you'll be, that's exciting. you'll be out of the commentary box for about four minutes and eight seconds or so, uh, before, three, four, while you race, before you jump back in. 